Yo, what is up? What is poppin'? Back at it again with another motivational video for y'all. I just want to chat with y'all and I really want to motivate y'all. I know like when it comes down to school, like, you know, some of y'all were probably in the classroom and, you know, some of y'all are probably still in school now. You probably a senior getting ready to graduate. You be in class and you don't really like be paying Oh, ooh, excuse me. You don't really like be paying very close attention in class because you be thinking about your goals and you be thinking about your dreams. Like when it comes down to your dreams, you be writing your dreams down. What I want to discuss with y'all is that a lot of successful people did not follow the school rules. And, and, and it really seems like in order to become successful, like if you really want to be successful, if you really want to be something bigger and better, if you if you follow all of the school rules, like exactly all the school rules, school is, is mainly just designed for you to be a worker. It's not I mean, it's not really like for people that want to be like something bigger or better. Like when you in school, they try to make it like the only way for you to make a living is by being a worker when that's not even the case. If you somebody that wants to be something bigger and better, go for it. There's nothing wrong about you writing your dreams down and there's nothing wrong about you writing your goals down in your notebook, being in class and not taking notes. Ain't nothing wrong about that. I mean, yeah, of course. I mean, yeah, of course, you're going to deal with, you know, maybe your parents telling you that you be in class and you be BS. And, but at the end of the day, you know that that stuff that you're learning in school is not going to serve you a purpose in life. There's even successful people that didn't even do their homework in school. You know, they probably paid somebody to do their homework or something. But I'm just giving y'all some motivation. If, if you somebody out there, you know, having trouble in school, you may be struggling. I'm, I'm just here to give you some motivation. A lot of people that are successful, a lot of the people that that you follow, that you follow on social media, a lot of them that did not follow the school rules. And let me break this down to you, too, just because it looks like they live in their best life on social media. That, that that that's that's not really what they're going through their life is not perfect the average person when it comes down to social media they're not going to post their depression they're going to post the good things on social media they're not going to post the bad things on social media they're not going to post their depression so don't don't let that social media stuff fool you you know yeah don't don't be getting depressed because of that because their life is not perfect <laughs> But at the same time, in order for them to become successful, they didn't follow all of the school rules. And if you really want to be successful, if you really want to be something bigger or better, you can't be following all of the school rules because at the end of the day, it's all designed for you to be a worker, for you to work a nine to five job that you don't even love. There's actually there's actually videos. There's actually videos on YouTube that actually explain why C students become more successful than A students. You know, like I said, all of us, we've been programmed, we've been brainwashed, and we've been lied to. And to my fellow people that have been subbed to my channel ever since I've been doing music, y'all heard that song before. My nigga, you officially been programmed, brainwashed, and lied to. A lot of us have... I've been programmed, brainwashed, and lied to. Little did I know, little did I know that the times when when I was, like, getting low grades, like, little did I know that, you know, I wasn't a failure. And, and you see, when I became, like, a straight-A student, when I became a straight-A student, when I had got, like, the academic endorsements with my diploma, I felt like I was on top of the world. You know, I felt like I was on top of the world. I felt like I was on top of the mountain. I felt amazing. Am I proud of myself? Yeah, I'm proud of myself. Sp yeah, I'm, I'm definitely proud of myself, especially. But at the same time, you know, I mean, I'm thankful for what I have. 
but at the same time, I'm not where I want to be. But I'm going to get where I want to be. I mean, I'm still grinding. I'm still working hard. And I'm still pushing the limits. You know, nothing You know, nothing is going to stop me. I'm going to keep on working. I never give up. No matter how tired I am. No matter how exhausted I am. No matter how depressed I am. I keep on going. I keep on fighting. No matter how much negativity I get. I keep on going. I keep it pushing. So, you, you know, I mean, a lot of successful people did not follow the school rules. So if you're somebody that wants to really be successful and you having trouble in a class and you having trouble in a subject, don't even feel bad because a lot of successful people did not follow all of the school rules. I just wanted to share, share this video with y'all, chat with y'all. You know, I really wanted to give y'all some motivation. You know, I mean, we don't we don't need and it's starting to seem to me that suicide rates are really on the rise. We really don't need any more people committing suicide. You know, that's why I mentioned that when it comes down to social media. When it comes down to social media, you know, I mean, you really, you know, that social media the stuff that these celebrities, these rappers and these celebrities put on social media, it's not real. That's, you know, they're not always happy. They they don't always have a smile on their face. People post good things on social media. They don't post what, what they personally be going through. They don't post when they're depressed or stuff like that. They always going to post the good things. That, that's the reason why social media is made to make you feel some type of way. I mean, think about it. Wake up. Be consciously aware. You know, I mean, see, me personally, I, I can look and, and, and tell. I mean, yeah, it may look like they're living their best life, but of course, they're not going to post the bad things that they're going through on social media. They're going to post the good things, and that's just how social me media is. But yeah, I just wanted to give y'all some motivation. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, love y'all.